That fire destroyed part of the multi-million dollar home in Lanikai. It broke out at the house on Mokulua Drive just before 5.30 this morning. As KITV4's Jill Kuramoto explains, the initial 911 call did not come from the homeowners or neighbors. The intensity of the fire can be seen and heard on this video shot by a neighbor. You heard a lot, a lot of happening noises. Um, basically, the uh, tires and stuff in the car were exploding. Neighbor Ron Cromer says the flames were coming from the garage. The flames were shooting above the roof, uh, probably a good 12 feet above the, the structure. When the first fire company got to scene, they witnessed the garage uh, partially uh, ignited. Uh, they're able to extend some hose lines and get it under control in about 10 minutes. Damage was contained to the home's garage, but it could have been worse if not for this car, what's left of this 2011 BMW 650. You see, the family in the home, two adults and a child, managed to escape the fire and said they tried to call 911, but only got a busy signal. Neighbors tell us they too couldn't get through when they called for help. But the car, equipped with an SOS feature, automatically alerted BMW dispatchers on the mainland when the fire triggered the car's emergency alarm. The mainland dispatchers then called 911 on Oahu. The fire damage, a charred scar on a luxurious four-bedroom, $5 million home that was being used over the weekend in a photo shoot for Pottery Barn. There's been a lot of uh, furniture being moved in and out of the house, uh, a couple big box trucks in there. Um, nothing real, uh, you know, invasive, but you could tell there was a lot of work going on. Firefighters were able to keep the fire from spreading to nearby homes. The cause is still under investigation. Jill Kuramoto, KITV4 News. Fire officials at the scene say they will look into the claims of problems with the 911 system. Damage from the fire is estimated at $310,000. We'll have more on that part of the story tonight at 6 and talk with one neighbor who says she has proof that the 911 number was not working when she tried to report the fire.